Welcome to a video from the DigitalLifestyle.com. We have new Windows 10 Redstone 5 build to look at. This is build 17730 for Windows inside on the fast ring. So this is Redstone 5, not the skip ahead, which is 19H1. Microsoft are really close to the end of the development of Redstone 5 now, so there aren't any new features apart from one which I'll show you in a second. So there's a couple of things like uh, better integration with HTTP slash 2 and... When you start up the the build after installing, you get the sort of the re, what they call the retail notifications, so the retail experience. So you get the same experience Windows users will get when the build is rolled out. And there's other changes like some Hyper V fixes uh, as well. But what is new? And this previously only worked on the um, uh, 19H one build was is your phone. So here it is your phone, and I've got this connected up to my. Uh, Google Pixel 2 Excel phone. So the, your phone app now works. It syncs up with your um, Android phone and you can interact with the pictures of it. Now, so so far it only does picture interaction, but I think in the future it's going to do a lot more messaging, notifications, that kind of thing. So what you're seeing here now is pictures that are on my Android phone. And I can take one of those pictures and drag it across onto the desktop like that. I can also double click on a picture and it will open it in uh, Picture Viewer. So it's a fairly basic feature, but it's pretty real time. If I um, take a picture on my phone, it'll pretty much come up straight away on the PC. Let me have a go at taking a picture of the screen. There you go, it's come through there pretty quick. So it's a nice way of taking pictures on your phone and being able to see them straight on there. And you can kind of do this through OneDrive, which is what I already do. This is a bit quicker, and I think it's going to introduce more features, like I said, notifications or other stuff. So that's the changes, really, with this build. Microsoft are really focusing on getting the last bugs out of the system before this goes live in a, in a few weeks. There are quite a few known issues. Clicking links from one app to the other may not work. Uh, there's still issues with Dart theme, some network flyout, some ease of access stuff, some Windows 10S mode. So there's still quite a bit of work to do um, for Windows uh, for the development team to get, before this is ready to roll out to all Windows users. But so they're not going to be adding any more features. They're going to be focused on getting those uh, fixes done. So that's it. That's the changes with this build 17730. You can see other builds and the fast the, the skip ahead ones, the newer builds um, or the the newer version of Windows on our YouTube channel. Thanks for watching this one. I'll see you on the next video.